Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Being Wendy. My name is Wendy, aka Mama Dana, and I do videos on motherhood, lifestyle, and anything that I feel like telling you guys about. So if you're new to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit that bell button to get notified anytime I post a video. So actually, today is Monday. I'm supposed to have uploaded a video today, but my laptop has really been acting up and for now I don't really have a laptop, but um you'll probably see this tomorrow or sometime during the week so if it's not tuesday it's on thursday because i'm supposed to upload on mondays and thursday so yeah so probably it's going to go up on thursday and for now i've decided to borrow my sister her laptop because i don't have a laptop yeah so today we're going to do something really simple and something really i just wanted to do for as a motivation to people who feel like makeup is not for them or they feel like they don't know how to do their makeup because uh, my first time to ever do makeup, uh, I was actually introduced by Obosha and she had come. We did a video together, so I will put the link up here so you guys can watch that video if you haven't. And that's the first time I ever had makeup on my face. Like all the makeup we used there was hers. So I was learning things and everything. So yeah, so I think let's just get straight to the video. If from the title you've seen, it's a really simple look, no foundation. Um really basic what i do to go to school what i do when i'm going to school every single day it doesn't take too much of my time but it might take today because i'm trying to show someone and don't be too worried so if you're a beginner like if it's really really your first time what you do and so disclaimer i am not a makeup artist so if i make mistakes don't judge me that's just i'm the process of learning i just felt it would be nice to share a few things with you and yeah let's let's get into it so i'm using um a pencil by usha my mom had traveled some time back and she brought them for us she bought a whole pack of like 20 or something and it's almost over so what i do first i'm, I'm looking this side because my mirror is here i have a small mirror here so i'm actually brushing my eyebrows upwards so if you're a beginner the best thing to do is if can go to ta if can have someone trim your eyebrows for you it's easier because you see they're shaped so it's going to be really easy to draw and fill them yes so the guy who does it is called zach for me it's called zach um his place is called zalux parlor and i will give you details on zalux parlor down below so you can follow them on instagram and yeah so what I do first is I draw the bottom according to this, according to the line, how it's, it's, it's been shaped. So I don't know how you guys can see. Gosh, it's been like two weeks. since I drew my eyebrows. How, how is the quarantine for you guys? Um, for me, it's very, what can I say? And actually, I'm doing my makeup for Don't Rush Challenge. Um, also, don't be scared to make mistakes. If you do, just, yeah, I think there's, there's a line that was, Hmm. I don't know if you guys, you guys can see clearly how I've drawn that. And then for the top one, let's it use the spoolie and you draw them down. That's how I do them because I like um thinner eyebrows. I'm trying to learn how to do the what is it called? I'm trying to learn how to do the natural looking eyebrows. Have you guys seen those? I've seen my cousin do it. Let me, I'll ask her what she does. They look so natural and she hasn't drawn lines like this. Hopefully they're the easier, they're like easier to draw. So don't stress yourself too much about making them look identical. Just make them look like distant cousins at least. Hmm? 
or even cousins because they can't look like identical twins can be for a tunnel they can be cousins they can be a bit of distance cousins but not too much at least let them look like relatives you get or best friends oh best friends don't even look alike so after you've drawn so you just fill them in the way you want um after i've drawn i normally feel so much relief in filling in Probably my be the best part of doing my eyebrows is filling in. I think I've filled them in okay. So I just take my spoolie and now just go through what I've filled so that it can look a bit more uniform and doesn't look exactly like strokes. Mm, strokes. <laughs> Different strokes. Yeah, so uh, my other phone got full filled um memory i guess i haven't used it in a minute so yeah so this um after i fill them in and use my spoolie to just brush it all so that you can remove the strokes um i take my angled brush i think that's what they call it um it's it's refusing to because it has this it's sharp it's not just straight, it's angled. So I used my concealer from Black Opal. It's in the shade 05 bronze. This is my shade. I went to, I bought it from Linton's. They tested it for me there. They tested it. Yeah, so um, I was telling, uh, I want to tell you guys, um, I feel like I was reading more when I was in school than now that I am at home um because I don't know I've just been feeling so lazy and there's so many distractions at home you guys Diana is always on my case she wakes me up early she sleeps late she wants my attention she's fighting with Moses and it's it's becoming a bit too much to handle i'm just like how am i going to handle this and yeah for me and then now this is my shade i don't like using a lighter shade or anything because this is what i'm doing daily so i don't think i feel i, I don't feel the need to be extra can you guys see i just drew and clearing the lines i can see there's something crooked here Mm. yeah just make it more uniform and clean i normally see the concealer it just cleans your eyebrows and i don't normally do the top part why i don't know i just don't i used to but then i didn't like how it turned out so after that what i do is i take this so this set of brushes actually bought it from dubois so it's nothing legit um and then this thing because it's like this, I just use it to clean, to clean up that concealer that I used. You get, you get it, honey? I bet you all do. So when I'm going to school, this is actually the most tasking thing I do on my face. I can say, I don't think I do anything else. My eyebrows are it. And then I'm done with my eyebrows. I just give me a minute. Left my powder in the bathroom. So I use this Pauline Cosmetics powder, um, super coverage compact powder by Pauline. It's in the shade Cocoa. I hope you guys. Oh, gosh, it's becoming hard. But it's in the shade Cocoa. I can't remember the price. I'm really bad at remembering prices of things, unless it's something I use daily. Can't really remember and yeah let's go all in with this powder
Mmm. Who's this? Gosh, I love this powder. I really do. Perfect shade for me. And I got it from Colin Cosmetics Westlands. They are main that like their stock. And I love that piece because I met Nelly. And if you want Pauline Cosmetics products, I have my friend's link. I will send it down below. She is very good and she'll shade match for you. She'll just, she's the best customer service. Okay, it go A1. It's A1. And then this is what I put on. Pauline Cosmetics lip gloss. This is what I have. I've been using it for a minute. So let's use this side. And the shade Caramel. It's actually um 500 bob and I, I sent my mom to get it for me at Super Cosmetics. And this is what she got. yeah that's it this this is practically how I, what i do most of the time oh it looks so cute actually i bet it looks this cute in me because i never my mom just um did this and let me show you how i wrap my head with a simple head wrap that i stole from my mother uh, she's trying to claim but it's mine but let me show you in a minute yeah so i'm just going to use this i mean my days are so guys um I'll probably just wear an outfit so that I can feel nice about myself today, yeah. Um just have to make sure they're equal. Gosh. Yeah, this is better. So I'm sorry, I'm sorry. And guys, I'm not a professional head dropper. What is that even a thing? What? Hey. Anyway, I know you get the, get what I mean. Um, I don't like covering the whole of my ear. Cause I want to put some bum earring to accessorize it. And yeah, so. This is what I do. I just twist it, twist and turn and turn and twist and turn and turn and twist. Mm -hmm. Get her setting. Ooh. So this is what I do. Actually, wrapping this thing was guesswork for me the first time because I'm not good at wrapping. I've never actually done this thing. Like, it's not, it's not something I, I do. This is something I've started doing recently because of my wig. And I wanted to look a bit different every day with the wig. I didn't want to always look like I'm wearing the exact same wig every single day. So I decided to learn how to wrap my head so that my wig can look different, different looks every day, different head wraps, color. And I really like the thing. So now I'm obsessed with head wraps and you guys are not going to change that. <laughs> yeah, so cute. I had shot this, I had shot this video before, but because of my... Mmm, who this? Yeah, so maybe I can just put on an outfit and show you how I'd complete the look. Wow. Definitely an outfit I am wearing to school. I love, 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 love this. Jeans. This. Yeah, simple outfit. Simple hair. I mean, simple head wrap. Simple makeup. And yeah, we're going, we're good to go. Earrings. If you need a necklace, maybe you can put something on, but I... I always forget to put on a necklace and yeah so i hope this tutorial is going to teach you how to do easy makeup and you're going to like how you look because i actually really like this 
um it's not too much it's very simple but actually really really genuinely like it and yeah so thank you so much for watching this video don't forget to like comment share and subscribe to our channel also before i end this video do not panic about the coronavirus try and stay at home leave only when you have to pray for those who really need to work to be able to eat and yeah i hope this makes us stronger as a country stronger as a people this makes you realize who you really need to show up for who you need to kick out of your life and yeah so i'm going to see you in the next video goodbye Ooh.